All right, welcome back everybody. Another uh, very nice day out there today, a little nicer maybe than yesterday uh, with less wind, but a uh, warm one out there. 78 the current temperature. We hit 80 for the high in Helena, tying a record high back in the 19th century. Uh, 80 degrees, uh, another day with uh, tying the record high in Helena. Great Falls, a little shy of the record, made it up to about uh, 73. That's our current temperature. It's a high temperature, 86 uh, was the record high here. But uh, look at the state, a little cooler the farther north and east you got up into the state here. But even 60s, not too bad this time of year, 60s and 70s all across the state. Missoula, very close to 80 degrees. A little breeze, a little east-southeast wind here in the central eastern part of the state. But that wind will switch around to the west and increase tomorrow. And much of central Montana is under a red flag warning for those dangerous fire weather conditions here. Uh, the wind will increase through the morning hours and through the afternoon and evening. That's a, a pretty strong west wind here. Uh, existing fires like the Yogo fire could grow uh, tomorrow in these conditions and new fires would take off like that if they were ignited. The wind will die down a little bit uh, for Friday, hence the wind on, wind off, and then the wind picks back up here as we get into uh, Saturday. Nothing really on the radar. I plotted a few of the fires that are technically still active here in the states. Uh, of course, uh, the Yogo fire, one of the most active, uh, largest fires uh, still burning in the state. Incredible work by the firefighters yesterday, limiting the growth in really tough conditions, red flag warning conditions. They limited that growth to between 50 and 100 acres, and it's going to be another tough day for the firefighters uh, out there tomorrow in the wind increasing. Very quiet weather again, with the exception of the northeast. All those little yellow boxes are severe thunderstorm warnings popping up and quiet in the Gulf ahead of Hurricane Delta that will likely make landfall in Louisiana coming up uh, this Friday. Wildfire smoke, we didn't really have any uh, in the state today. That is changing though as the sun continues to go down here this evening. Look off towards the southwest and you'll see some of that smoke that is moving through Oregon into Idaho. Even extreme southern Montana starting to see some of that wildfire smoke coming in from California here. Uh, southwest flow increasing and that will blow in the smoke and also blow up the fire danger uh, for tomorrow. Record highs potentially again uh, here for parts of Montana. Friday, a little cooler, not as much in the way of wind heading into Saturday. Look at all this moisture moving through the Pacific Northwest. Uh, Montana will start off partly cloudy with uh, warm temperatures and more wind, meaning more fire danger. But look what happens through Saturday late in the evening, overnight into Sunday morning, mixed rain and snow showers on Sunday, and it certainly will be a much cooler day, tougher day to be outside because of the wind as well. Monday, another little system coming through with maybe not a ton of wet weather, but we'll take any here at this point. It will certainly help with our fire danger. 40s here for tonight with skies mainly on the clear side. We'll have a little in the way of some smoke increasing over southwest Montana. Here's the forecast for tomorrow. Windy, warm, high fire danger, smoky skies. It will not be as nice of a day uh, like it was uh, out here for today. Uh, Friday, maybe still a little smoke and some haze, slightly cooler, not as much wind. Temperatures into the 70s. Here comes the front on Saturday. Uh, clouds will increase through the day. Look at the cooler weather closer to the front, warm and windy out ahead of the cold front. And then here that front goes through overnight, Saturday night into Sunday morning. Maybe even some snow mixing down to around 5,000 feet. I don't think it'll accumulate much unless you head way up into the mountains, but a much cooler, windy day with some mixed rain and snow showers here on Sunday. Here's the seven day forecast for Helena. So watch the fire danger the next few days. The air quality uh, will deteriorate tomorrow as well. This weekend, chillier changes Saturday night into Sunday. We'll have a couple more showers maybe around Monday and Wednesday of next week for Great Falls near record highs tomorrow. Watch that fire danger and some big time changes coming to everyone this weekend. Coming up, the pandemic is giving one student who lives near the Canadian border a new opportunity.